this. Yeah, we could do that. Let's be honest, she knows what she's doing. He did pretty well, to be fair. I know what was going through his head the whole time. Lord, have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Do you know how this fire started? Yes, I do. It was because of my cousin. And I don't want to mention no names. Your cousin? Yes. Um, and you say you think your cousin started this. Uh, do you know how or why? He's mad because he couldn't. He can't get with me. I'm married to my husband. And it's a long story. Just make it short. Sweet home Alabama. How many times has a guy complimented you in the last month? Like on what? Anything? Anything. Like Wait, when you've gone out and physical stuff. Physical or? Could be anything. Literally anyone? Just total amount? Yeah, just like I mean, every time tonight, you go out in the last I'm month. I'm like 30, so I don't 30? know about the month. A mother, right? Have you ever asked them, have they been attacked, assaulted? Yes. yes. Okay, and what would they say to you? They haven't. Exactly. But do you think that's honestly true, or do you think that that's what they told you? How many men do you know that have assaulted a woman? None? How, okay. how does the math on that add up? You do realize that not all, all men are ah. this, right? What is this woman on? Someone said in the comments she's arguing with her own thoughts. What does a 500 pound canary say? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> I knock you the fuck out. That joke was mid as fuck, and you belong in a mental ward for saying that trash shit. What did he say? Hey. Oh. I'm still a mom, but these are the years that I'm supposed to be naked with my titties out, ass out. Yeah. In my head, it just doesn't sound right when she says I'm still a mum, but these are my years that I should be naked. And I'm pretty sure she's with Travis Scott, ain't she? So why does she need everybody else to see her body for validation? Why can't she just be happy with her man's attention? I'll tell you why, it's because she's grown up with the Kardashians. You teasing me, you naughty naughty. <laughs> you stupid ass bitch, I fuck a witch. A few minutes later. Yeah, I give her fucking everything. It'll get better, the pain gets easier. Keep putting yourself out there, surround yourself with your friends. One day you'll look back and you'll think that shit made me stronger. Where are you from? Colombia. Oh shit, were you taking me sometime? Yes. She said yes, she don't understand, but we're going to Colombia. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Wow. <laughs> Say mommy? Mamacita. Ah, you mamacita? I'm papi? Papi. Oh shit. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> How do you feel that you've lost? What? He's written at the end there, simp. Now let's get this straight, fellas. You're not a simp because you're attracted to another woman and she's attracted to you. You're a simp if you're putting a woman on a pedestal that doesn't give a shit about you, if there's imbalance. She seemed like good vibes and good fun. When you're a young guy, you got to enjoy yourself as well, right? I'd be like, oh, look at my bicep, look at my abs. Okay, show me your legs, though. Okay. Now joking aside fellas, if you're going to the gym consistently, well done, but don't forget to take care of them legs. You don't want to be looking like Johnny Bravo, bruv. Another thing you need to take care of is your skin. If you want an easy way to improve your skin, then start investing in products to achieve clear and healthy skin. With the products that I personally use from today's sponsor, T Chanley, your skin's going to look so much better and if you look better, you're going to feel better. You've heard me talk about them before and I'm going to keep talking about them because I know the positive impact their products will have on your life. I recommend you start with their level 1 system which comes with all the basics, a daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20 and a PM moisturizer. Also every box comes with an instruction card that makes the whole process really easy. Their products are amazing but you don't just have to take my word for it because they have over 5,000 star reviews from customers around the globe. Because T Chanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my viewers a great deal. Just click the first link in the description and you'll get 30% off your first box plus a free gift. Click that link and get started today. Is there anything that you learned from your previous heartbreak. Do not get back together with them. Rate me from one to ten. A nine. Eight. An eight. Hey. Oh, Jenny. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Hey, you ready for this? Ten. 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 Oh, man. Hey, oh, man. Blondie wants you bad, brother. But let's stop the cap. They're not all tens. I don't think any of them are tens. Why is it okay for women to say that they want to date millionaires, but if men say they want to date size twos, they're considered shallow or misogynistic? It's facts! It's facts! These are not facts. These sizes are not facts. What would you do if I was there?
<laughs> Ain't no simple what I'm about, bruv. How many men have you slept with? Like now? Yeah. God, honestly. I don't know. Rough My body guess. count when I was 14 was seven. Your body count of 14 was seven? seven. That's fucked. You was doing it? numbers, girl. If we had a fight, how would you make it up to me? Contestant number one. Hey, how are you? I missed you. Um, <laughs> so I would gaslight you into <laughs> you thinking you're the problem, and then I would Never abuse mind. you emotionally to you get to a point where you only get satisfaction from me if I tell <laughs> you you look good or anything like that, and then I would start slightly treating you better so you'd think I'm changing, and then I it would be this off and on until you're almost hooked for life, and I'm like, almost like a drug to you, where even when you're not around me and we break up, like you're yearning for me, like nicotine. Oh, and if that doesn't work, I'd get uh, go to a movie. <laughs> <laughs> if all else fails, a movie, okay. All right, who are you most attracted to? She's the picking him. The black jacket. You said the first one. I know he was joking, but that shit was getting scarily accurate. This guy was funny throughout the whole thing as well. Take a look at this. What is your body count? Contestant number one. I mean, it's really hard to keep count because anytime I can open the flower of a mistress and feel the inside of a uterine wall, I, I don't even have the ability to count, to be completely honest, because I'm so excited to be there. Um, <laughs> but if I had a ballpark it, more than a couple, I'd say. So three? Three. I've been in more bushes than we've had presidents, I'll say that. Okay. <laughs> There's been two bushes. <laughs> Where your new name is, we just moved in. Oh, oh. my wife paid right, right now. <laughs> Get the Oh, 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 shiver my timbers. Shut up, man. Out of your friends, which of their girlfriends would you rather be with? That guy with the moustache in the corner, the gelé on. His, his girlfriend, unreal. She would get it any day of the week. Left, right and centre, she's getting back. Now I like to have a joke with my friends, but he took that shit way too far. There's a line and he crossed it. I don't know how the other guy reacted afterwards, but in the moment I thought he was doing pretty well to stay unbothered. It seemed like he was just sat there thinking you wouldn't have a chance even if you tried. Oh, it's a bird, it's a bird. Where? It's a bird. Where, bro? Oh, I... Oh, I thought it was a bird in your nest. <laughs> <laughs>